Hey, yo, welcome back. Let's get started. Oh, shit. Interesting. What is what is what is this? Oh, okay. Oh, you dick. Oh. Yeah, I'm, I'm not that big a fan of the circle of this one. It's interesting. And <clears throat> enough of this. Let him play with the kitten. The kitten? They brought a Narcacuga? <laughs> Anyone else? <laughs> They're like, fuck this. 
<laughs> I I don't get paid enough for this dead. shit. Let them. There's been more than enough bloodshed for one day. Ooh. Murderer. All of our friends are dead because of you. Do you hear me? They used us as bait. Bait to lure you out of your stinking hole. All because you couldn't just let things be. What are you even doing here? We never asked to be saved. Did you think we'd thank you? They'll never forgive us. We're all marked now. For five years, we fought to secure a better life for our kind. To see that we are treated as equals. Do you not want that? What we want is to be left alone. Every time you show your faces, it is we who suffer. It's all right. Oh, do I not have the mark anymore? I'm sorry. How did we get rid of the mark? Usually people burn it off. Just leave us be. This is our home, and this is where we will stay. I didn't even notice that the mark was gone. Sid told us this wouldn't be easy. They'll come round. If you say so. We should go. Going to what's left of the hideaway. <clears throat> Honestly. That night five years ago, we destroyed what for many was a symbol of hope. For a reason they'll never know. We cannot blame them for thinking us the cause of their misery. Though it's to give them a better tomorrow. They see only that we've made their lives harder today. Yet the boil must be lanced if it is to heal. I can't help but wonder if we've made the right choice. When Sid said that he wanted to create a world where we were free. Free to choose our own path. I honestly don't think it mattered to him if that choice was right or wrong only that it was our own I miss him <laughs> a world where we can live and die as equals that's what he wanted what we want and that's why I bear his name it's why we've all chosen to bear his legacy okay yeah it is somewhat and burned I think I'm not going to let anything Stand in our way. Rides over, lovebirds, home sweet home. <coughs> oh, okay, so we have a new hideaway. Ob obviously, we have a new hideaway. Sweet home. Otto was asking after you. Let's go and see him. Uh, never a dull moment. New crafting recipes. Sweet. Anything down here? 
No. Alright, cool. Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> I might make this episode a wee bit shorter because the last one was longer. So I'll try to end it at the 20 minute mark. <sighs> eh, we'll see. All operations are suspended. Ah, there you are, Claude. Word of your adventures arrived this morning. Victor sends his thanks. <laughs> I doubt Kupka will miss the fools he sent to catch me. Not a single one of the bearers we saved showed any interest in coming with us. No one seems keen to join hands with an outlaw. Any news while we were away? None worth mentioning. Gav's still off keeping an eye on the Republican army. Should be back any day now. Was that a pun? Was that a pun because he's missing an eye now? <clears throat> Can't work that one out. There must be better places than the hull of a gutted airship to bury your nose in a book. Yet this is where she's chosen to be. And I'm sure she has her reasons. Hey. <clears throat> How you doing? Trust I'm not intruding. Back from your mission? I'm beginning to think your habit of surviving cannot be attributed to luck alone. One might say the same of you. Vivian Ninetales. I'll have you know that only four attempts have been made on my life, and none was especially memorable. So, to what do I owe the honor? <laughs> Could it be that you've come for one of my lessons? <laughs> Is that so hard to believe? Very well, then. Shall we start with the state of the realm? To absolutely no one's surprise, she finds herself at the mercy of armies and outlaws. Well, mostly <coughs> armies. Though that's not for want of trying, is it, Clyde? But the real question is, how did we get here? Well, you see... When a mommy Sid and a daddy Sid Long love each other so much, the they birth a hideout. Recent days have seen the blight wrest ever more land from her grasp. <sighs> For which reason she has continued to wage war on her rival across the strait, hoping to claim less blackened pastures. But Odin would sooner pawn his sword than Walud relinquish Ash. And the Empire pays dearly for every blade of grass rent beneath Sambraqua boots. Little wonder then that Sylvester set his sights on the crystalline dominion, an altogether easier target, possessed of no less ether. It was five years ago, while you were busying yourself with the destruction of Drake's head, that the Empire made its move, subjugating its theretofore neutral neighbor nation which could legitimately claim to be the center of the world certainly there is no better place to stage an army from there the holy empire's reach spans the twins the non-aggression treaty was the only thing keeping them in check but if they truly broke the pact without provocation it is only a matter of time before others reply in kind the and the Empire, black parts are the, the, the blight. Republic, the kingdom of Walud. And of course, our friends in Yara. Who will be left standing, I wonder, when the last drop of blood is spilled? You were born in Twinside. Do you not fear for your home? Oh, dark clouds are wont to gather over the Dominion. Yet, in spite of it all, she has ever endured. And when the storm has passed, I am confident she will remain. Now, as to the matter of payment for today's lesson, complete a simple errand for me, and we shall consider ourselves even. <laughs> even. Right. <laughs> Return his volume to old times in the uh. Tell him it was um, adequate. I suppose it wouldn't hurt to visit our resident historian. Interesting. Uh, 
Hi, Jill. Rosman Harpocrates. Now that is a name I have not heard for a long time. So long, in fact, I had half forgotten it was mine. Welcome mood. Fucking mood. I believe this belongs to you. Vivian asked me to return it. Ready. <laughs> Our resident scholar devours books faster than Except, the like, does that happens to do deal with my Would birthday. I like, I sometimes. Not even my birthday. No it's just I forget how old I am. And then, like, my phone reminds me when it's getting close. It's like, oh, yeah, you're turning 29 this year. It's like, ah, uh, Do you mean we literally have one in the hideaway? Yet they laugh far too little for one so young. <laughs> the loss of their parents weighs heavy on them. However well they hide it. Titan took much from us that night. From some more than others. And the wounds that remain. They are not I wonder if uh Which is why we now now that I think about it, I wonder if the quests that, that uh we're in the hideaway. The other one will transfer over to this if you don't do them. Because they wouldn't just lock you out of certain quests, would they? Okay, so this is mainly just... You could pause that if you want. I know that was really fast. Yep, certain things just transfer. Not like a blink, and you're already off solving everyone's problems. It looks good, Clive. Goes well with the scowl. I'd had that brand for so long. I'd forgotten what life was like without it. What it was like to be myself. And it's all thanks to you, Talia. The scalpel did most of the work. Oh, ah, scalpel. Forget, Ugh, it's not burned. She scalpeled it off. Not a stolas. All right, I'll have a look. And then you get some rest. I will not elaborate to anyone who know who doesn't know. Ah, oh, I like her ponytail. Oh. Could you have a thought worthy of a letter? I think it like. Ble I've it's never seen her walk away, so I never noticed her ponytail. Ooh, ooh what's this? Oh, Wall of Memories. Okay. Okay. What does Gav have to say? The Republican army is on the march, leaving Randala in Hugo Kupka's charge. With him and his men occupied with the defense of the capital. They're less likely to trouble us. Good news, then. For now. It's more than that. This is our chance. The one we've been waiting for. But look how far we've come. All that we have here, our friends, the hideaway, are they not cause for joy? Five years. 
five long well, days. it's been 20 minutes, and I haven't ended the episode. <laughs> you might have achieved so much <clears throat> more. But each time I reach for it, it's like something is holding me back. Summoning an icon exacts a price not easily paid. Your body knows this only too well. It's merely trying to save you from yourself. And every burden I cannot bear falls to you. This mission of ours has made me question everything I thought I knew. But one thing has become abundantly clear. The crystals take more than they give. In exchange for momentary comfort, we must endure a lifetime of pain, war after war, loss upon loss. And now? Now they rob us of our very homes, leaving naught but dust and ash. But you're trying to change that. We are trying to change that. And to me, that's no burden. I know, but... Try not to forget. We're only here because Joshua gave us a second chance. It would be a pity to waste such a precious gift. He did. He was there. It wasn't an illusion. I heard him call out. Ultima. If Joshua is still alive, he'll be looking for that... that thing. Do you think he will ever come back? I know he will. And we must be ready when he does. Now the mother crystals would be fine if they didn't take so much. Joshua! And so the north is lost. that the blight spread ever more swiftly your grace but this this is far far worse than any could have imagined it is only a matter of time before the twins are no more the world marches ever closer to its end and here we chase shadows tell me brother Efforts in vain. Master Clive, a moment, if you. Oh, my apologies, I didn't mean to intrude. Come, join us, have a drink. Uh, we were just discussing strategy. Speak freely, Otto. It's Martha, from the inn. She's gone missing. Anyway, I'll be in the mess when you've finished. Very well. <clears throat> the Gathering Storm. What would make Martha leave the rest? All right, well, I said I was going to cut this one short. I will cut this one short. Thank you for joining me on this adventure so far. I really appreciate it. This has been a wild ride. <sighs> I might take a break here for a little bit. Maybe schedule some videos. But uh, this, this is great. 
Th like, comment, subscribe if you so choose to. And I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye!